hi guys item seven this lovers how is everyone doing guys you know i so care about you i always ask after you so guys today we are with another banger we are gonna be making on her authentic on her soup so this i mean this on her soup is so tasty and delicious just if you make it just the way i'm about to do right now so guys in this recipe we're gonna be using goat's meat so in the fire i will add my pot and then i will added my goat's meat into the pot and then next i'm gonna be using this beautifully scent I mean the aroma in this yellow pepper is heavenly it's recommended to use it in this offer in this um, oha recipe I'm gonna be adding just minimal of onions because we're gonna also be using okiri so be careful with much onions when cooking this I'm gonna be adding the seasoning cube also I'm using star cube and so I'm gonna be adding water just a little water the quantity that will help me pre-boil the goat meat goat meat usually does not take long so i'm gonna be boiling this for just five minutes it's a male goat and you want to not cook for a long time just get the male goat male goat is usually very very easy and soft all right so next i'm gonna allow it to boil for five minutes maximum and it will be 70 percent done added my salt and I will allow that to cook I'll cover it and allow it to cook and then next I'm gonna be adding my dry catfish and bomo bomo have no taste guys but that catfish is gonna give me the taste I require bomo is just for the pleasure <laughs> and then I'm gonna be adding my oguri I mean this recipe this particular one you do not miss it oguri is necessary and right now I'm gonna be adding the quantity of water that will be enough for me to use according to the quantity of my offo. You can see my offo. I'm using offo as a thickener in this recipe. You can actually want to use a day actually it depends on you. I prefer using offo in this one. So I'm gonna add my red oil in my offo and I'll give it a very good stir. I mean you have to make sure that you stir it to be very very smooth um, with no lump so I'm gonna mix this very well so it becomes so very tender so after this I'm gonna just take it right into my boiling stock it's boiling beautifully so I'm gonna be adding my offo this offo is gonna give it the consistency that I need is enough or for little of what can actually give you the thickness that you want if you use much you have to be careful if you use, you use much of a form and you might not like it it will come out so differently so at this point my offer is boiling beautifully well and and um, for the record this is not the end end the process of the thickness it's still gonna thick as it cook so I'm adding my crayfish and I'm adding my scented pizza leaves you can as well what you use Seed, but I prefer this pizza fresh leaf in this recipe. I mean, this is gonna bring the aroma alive at this point. Oh my goodness, the aroma is everywhere. I mean, the aroma of Uziza, Uziza is so powerful, guys. And so, right now, I'm adding my on her, the almighty on her. Usually, it's recommended not to slice your hair, but if you want to, it's optional. It's nothing spoiled, nothing, nothing, nothing spoiled when you want to slice your hair. But I prefer not to because I prefer chewing my own hair like that. I want to see it large into my pot of soup. And as it is right now, oh my goodness, I'm just gonna allow it to cook for five minutes because on hair, usually, it's very, very tender. It's not hard, it's boiling pretty well and tana as soup is ready oh my god after five minutes like i told you on her is very tender it's not like ugu or pumpkin leaf they um, cooking it for three four minutes five it's enough i mean oh god you can enjoy this soup any swallow of your choice i mean at this point here 